Uh, welcome friends in our tutorial video in this video we are going to show you how to export your tabular data from your database to a file and it the file could be a csv or a text file in our last video we have seen that how to export the data from your database table to a data file and by using import and export wizard which is the feature of a sql server now here we are not going to using that wizard uh, again we are using bcp utility so bcp utility simply simply stand for bulk copy program so it is very easy uh, to use here so before using B bcp utility you have the admin access right or essential access right to pull the data from your database to a file so here what we are going to do here we are you and then going to type bcp then you can see all the support uh, things are available here for example, uh, before run the BCP command, we need to check which data we are going to pull from the database. For this, we are using this table, table uh, data to export into our raw data file. So here, what we are going to do, that we are using BCP command then the name of the database that is reports d then the schema then a table name tbl sales orders because we are using out we are not using any query you can use the query also then the path of the file where we need to store it that is copy and paste and name of the file that is sales orders then the server credential uh, because we are I am using local server so I am using dot yeah if you are using any other server you need to pass the name of the server then I need to pass the character types and the field terminator so I am using comma as a field terminator so I am passing it then I need to pass the trusted connection that means i am not going to pass the login id and password over here and just execute this query oh there is something wrong so i need to do uh, the, the name of the table is incorrect it should be sales order and i am going to pass it run it again now you can see the file has been generated that is text document now what I am going to do I am going to do again then pass it dot csv csv ok and run it again Now you can see a CSV and text file is generated. Now, now I am going to open it. Now you can see all the data is available here. But one thing is missing that uh, the header of the column is missing. Yeah. So it is very easy to use a bulk copy bcp command to export your data from database to your data file please subscribe my channel on youtube for more videos on ssrs ssis and sql server